today is another batch of executive presses masterclass for BMW. And I, I love discussing with them the last part for this for this day, which is letting go. You know, in a person's um, personal development, letting go is something that we or we usually skip. <laughs> the thing is when we don't let go of the things or aspects of our life that weighs us down, we miss out unleashing our fullest potential. So samples of the letting go that I discussed with them earlier is to let go of your past. That, um, well, we don't totally let go of the past, but we need to understand what happened in the past. Afterwards is letting go of your ambition, especially if it's too much when your ambition is already higher than your purpose. Next to let go is your wrong relationship. You see, there's no such thing as wrong but right. When it's wrong relationship, it's wrong relationship. You have to let it go because it is not worth it. Last but not least, among the many things that we need to prioritize in letting go is ourselves. If ourselves has become so far, from who God has designed us to be, we need to reconnect, to God, reconnect with God. We assess ourselves, Lord. Um, I need. I think I need to let go of who I have become, especially if it is not someone whom You have designed me to be. So there you go. Tomorrow is our day two, and I'm so excited on helping them discover themselves more as they did today, as they day one. And tomorrow we go to stage two, which is um, learning how to inspire others. So again, let's all aspire to be an inspiration, to influence and create positive impact, to be extraordinary inside and out. I would like to thank you for sharing all your experiences, pain, happiness and achievements, and especially your knowledge. On how we can on how we can improve, uh, and how I can understand and know more about myself, and also how I can set my own self improvement. Uh, through you, I was enlightened on my perspective, beliefs, and vision on life, and also my purpose and goals. Thank you. Thank you for being an effective teacher to all of us. Now I have learned that I have to understand my behavior and where that behavior coming from. Thank you for teaching us to accept and to let go. Thank you for teaching us proper clothing, proper posture, and dining etiquette. I have learned really a lot. From now on, I will start all my learnings from you effective immediately. I thank the Lord for this opportunity that I get to know you. Such a blessing that it happened to be in my line of work. I am still in awe of how God moved into your life and to your family. Also, the way you minister through your work. I hope I would. I pray that the Lord will continue to bless and provide with you the strength, blessings that overflows in you and through you. I hope this won't be the last time we meet each other. Till next time. Letting us understand our past help you realize that it is really a big part of improving myself. Thank you for being the inspiration to become better and at the same time including God in the process in our day-to-day -day lives. So I thank you for giving us this opportunity to make ourselves not only uh, better, not only in a professional setting, but also in our personal lives. How can I ever thank you for helping me understand who I really am and for teaching me ways on how to survive and grow? For unearthing the heavy loads I buried with the last activity, by the way, and for making me realize that God is in every form. I now know and understand that it all happens for a reason. And thank you for showing me ways to dress properly and behave. This changed my mindset and my perspective. And I owe it all to you. You and this training is indeed a blessing. I've learned a lot from these past two days and I hope I'll be able to apply these soon. The realizations have hit their mark and you can bet that I will do something about all of this. Please continue to inspire and transform others. Thank you and God bless you. What a very meaningful two-day executive presence that, uh, that I facilitated for BMW Batch 3. So during the ending of our workshop, I have emphasized to them, 
that one of the secrets to have empowered executive presence is consistency and authenticity. I also, I also encourage you to experience your life to the fullest by, by being authentic and consistent. Align yourselves with God and let's all inspire, influence, and create positive impact to become extraordinary inside and out.